the Berkeley Institute for Data Science has been a basically a crossroads um, location where people can come together, they can send their postdocs on there to work together, um, building up a bit of a common language. I was born in San Diego, but I grew up in Tijuana on the other side of the border. My family and I moved to San Diego when I was about 15 years old and I spoke zero English. So I missed out on a lot of information in high school. Then when I was a junior, my mom gave me a universe magazine and I was just blown away by these pictures of the planets and, and how much they could tell by taking images of them. And that's when I first thought of, of studying science. The first job of the Brooklyn Institute for Data Science is just to bring people into a common space where they get to know each other and they know who has the interesting problems and who has interesting solutions that they can, they can uh, be hearing about and sharing. But we also um, have identified common problems that need extra discussions of how we actually can solve problems in the world when we can use all of our expertise together. I got my acceptance letter from Berkeley and I was super excited and uh, after accepting I learned that um, I got the Regents and Chancellor Scholarship and I was blown away. From that moment on I became like a, a full-time student and I was able to dedicate all of my free time to my true passion which is learning about physics. Interestingly my own research in, in uh, physics and cosmology um, ended up being very dependent on all the things that were becoming available in with computers and with what was uh, what we now call data science and we were able to analyze data and analyze large amounts of data and use new sophisticated approaches to find basically the uh, tools and, and the, uh, the events that we used to measure the expansion of the universe. When the possibility was presented that we could start building a data science institute um, here at Berkeley for the whole university, it seemed to me like it was a, a really exciting and, and, uh, and you know, natural interest of mine because anything that would speed up the, um, our ability to use data science would speed up my own research. And of course, that was the case for um, almost uh, you know, a, well, a huge fraction of the campus. How would I like to think of the work that I've been doing lighting the way um, for, for future generations. To some extent, I, I think just the most poetic aspect of this is the idea that humans working together in, in large groups can address what seem like impossible questions. Already, I think that's just inspiring. If you would have told me when I was 15 that I was going to end up studying at this top research institution, I would have probably laughed. Berkeley's broad research opportunities have really enabled me to explore and in a sense light my own way to find the research that I'm truly passionate about. I'm always interested in seeing what is it that can make it possible for us to do more of what we do best and let the computers help us do that. I think that people have forgotten often um, how successful um, humans have been in solving major world problems and, and local problems of all sorts. You have experts in almost every area who care about the public good in a, in a way that is, uh, as I think, special and that um, make, can make it possible for this kind of group of people to do something that is hard to do elsewhere.